Hey there, it's Corey. In this video, we're gonna be taking a look at what key components are crucial to build a beautiful groundwork to have a successful run with Pantovision T2. When you first open up Pantovision, you will need to do a few bits of groundwork to get going to start doing pantograph quilting. The first thing that you're going to want to do is set your quilt size. So we're gonna come up into settings, quilt size, and enter in the width and height of the quilt that we're working on. In this instance, I'm doing a 54 by 54 quilt. So you'll enter in those measurements and you'll click accept. Now that you have that done, you need to tell Pantovision where the machine is at in relation to the actual quilt itself. So I'm gonna put the machine at the upper left-hand corner, just like so. Now that we have it set at the upper left corner in the software, we're gonna to go to our reposition feature and choose the upper left corner of our quilt grid. So we can zoom into that section and move over to the upper left. If you accidentally click a section, just tap on reset, and then you can tap in the upper left corner of your grid. You can click reset and tap as many times as you would like to get it exactly where you want. Once you have it where you would like it, you can tap align to quilt and then full view. Now you have your grid set at 54 by 54 and it's set to get ready to start quilting. A few things with gesture control that we should go over as well is with your Pantovision, this is a touch screen tablet. To zoom in, you would pinch and zoom into the screen. To zoom out, you'll pull your fingers closer together. To pan around the screen, you'll use two fingers and move those around just like that.